purchasing power parity is the same as the law of one price. It's just slightly more general. It basically also says a good must sell for the same price in different locations. So for example, if we look at the price of Big Mac in US and Japan, let P denotes how much Big Mac cost in US, which is probably around $5. And let P star denotes how much Big Mac costs in Japan. And let E denotes the exchange rate between yen and the dollar. Then according to law of one price, this same good Big Mac should sell for the same price in US and Japan. In Japan, the price of Big Mac is P star in Japanese yen. In US, the price of Big Mac is P in terms of dollar. When we convert P dollar into Japanese yen, we simply multiply it by the conversion rate or exchange rate E. So according to law of one price OPPP, um, the price of Big Mac in US when measured in yen should be equal to the price of Big Mac in Japan measured in yen. This relationship that connects exchange rate with domestic price and the foreign price is known as purchasing power parity or PPP. We can rearrange this equation by divide both sides by P. Then we end up with exchange rate equal to foreign price divided by domestic price. This links exchange rate between different currencies to the relative price ratio of different countries.